Cold start. I'm gonna take you along with me to the car wash. I'm gonna show you guys how to do a car wash. We are not gonna be touching the vehicle in this video except for drying it. And I'm just gonna show you, say if you live in an apartment complex or you don't have access to a hose, I'm just gonna show you guys how to clean the car off in a self car wash. Ugh, that is absolutely disgusting. You got bird shit. So guys, let's put this into sport mode because you know can't drive in normal mode we gotta have a little fun while we get there give you guys a nice pov let the car warm up just a little bit more and then we're gonna be on our way all righty guys we are on our way to the car wash I would do a pull for you guys right now, but you know, the car is still cold. Alrighty guys, we're gonna start off with a pre-soak on the car. So now when you're doing the pre-soak guys, make sure you get all up in every single little crack. Make sure this is where you really wanna try and loosen up all the dirt, the bugs and all the nastiness. So make sure you get all down by the door sill, the jams. Of course, don't forget about the mirrors because you know, a lot of people actually forget them. So you wanna make sure you get respot. spot Oh, that's absolutely disgusting. So next up, guys, you're gonna do the high pressure soap. So now after you got the soap done, you're gonna go to uh, you're gonna go to high pressure rinse. And I like to start from the top to get it all, just get it all off. Ah, oh, nice scat pack guys, that's actually twin turbo. So we're gonna get all the top off first, get all that soap off. All the soap off from the top. That way you don't have to keep redoing it, going back to the top, because it's all gonna keep shooting up. So I like to start off with the top first. Make sure you get all into there. down there. Guys, look how much cleaner it looks already. There's no bird shit. 
The back looks so much better. Now we're gonna get the hood. We'll get all the wheel wells now. Look how much cleaner that wheel looks. Looks so good. So now that after you're done cleaning off the car, you're gonna take a microfiber towel and you're just gonna rinse down the entire car because if you leave it like this, you're gonna get a bunch of water spots all over the car and that's not good. I mean, my car actually has a decent amount. I gotta get some water spot removal and do that, but that'll be for the next video. So we're just gonna lightly dry this car off we're not gonna apply too much pressure because if you do, you can also scratch the car. All right, just go. In straight lines, never wanna go. Make sure you get the mirrors, get all underneath it, around it, because this will drop water and it'll mess up all your hard work of drying off the car. Make sure you get the roof. Make sure to get in between all the tail lights. Oh yeah, it looks so much better. So now that once the car is done drying off, you are pretty much all done. And make sure you get all the jams. So make sure it leaks into the trunk too. So make sure you clean out the trunk and the door jams. <clears throat> Looks good as new. <sighs> C4 
so guys, that is how you clean off your car. Super simple, easy process. Should take you no longer than 30, 40 minutes. You love to see it guys when you get the love going out just so car wash. You know, that's what it's all about. Love seeing the people's faces and how happy they are. But yeah guys, so, and that is how you clean off your car. Make sure you guys do comment down below what you thought of this video. I will be doing a part two of how to get rid of water spot removals if this video gets let's say 50 likes so make sure you guys do drop a thumbs up i'll catch you guys on the next one but for now i'll let you guys get some pov driving and hear this beast